Alright, what's up everybody? Welcome to episode 19 of the Breath of Fire 3 Pseudo Randomizer. We are getting close to the end, but we still got some stuff we gotta do. I gotta get out of here and go get items, because I am short on vitamins. I've got 29 of them. We've got a bunch of bosses to go through for the boss rush, so I definitely need some ding-dang healing items. I think I'm getting low on ammonia, too. Oh, yeah, 26, now that's that's a lot. Uh, I guess I'll just stock up on everything I've got. We actually get to check on the fairies one more time, too. Cool. Um, oh, it should be noted, by the way, that thanks to my best friend Jared, the jellyfish that we caught <laughs> at on our last fishing trip and dragged across the desert with us now has a name. It's uh, Emmanuel the Man of War. So <laughs> he's, he's our buddy. He's a little dried out right now. I think he's still kicking, though. But, uh, yep, we he's got to meet God, too, man. He's got questions. All right. <laughs> like, it, it, number one question he's got, why do we have to bite on every kind of lore? Why did you make me like this? Anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to take a trip out of Karazhan now that we have a quick way to get back in, I'm pretty sure. And we're going to go and get stocked up on items here. This could be a decently long one, by the way. Oh, I didn't do the thing yet. That was silly of me. Oops. Yeah, this could be a decently long episode, by the way, because I want to do the whole boss rush and get all of our items and everything else before we go and do the task. Oh, wait, I already did this. Let me go up here. What? Am I really going to go back and forth on this panel again? There we go. <laughs> so that should open up the very beginning of Karajan. Like, to the elevator. And this should get us there from this area. When we get rid of the lasers. If I'm not mistaken. If I am mistaken, we got a long walk back to go get items. But we're definitely going to do it. Because... I'm scared. It's gotta be you guys. Has it gotta be you guys? I don't think Ray Scirocco is gonna do much. No sleep. Until Brooklyn. Nice. Nice. Fury Cat's got his own chair right next to me now, so he'll stop jumping on my lap every now and then. I assume eventually he'll jump on, on my lap anyway, but he's just chilling right now, being a good kitty. Being a good boy. I think this is right, that we can just walk out this way. Armor, alright. Oh, let's do a round of attacks and try and break it. Don't put anybody to sleep. Dang it. You know, that makes no sense. Frost Strike putting you to sleep makes no sense. They just wanted to attach a friggin' oh, nice scar. Oh, I forgot, those are basically eggs. Um, they just wanted to attach a uh, status effect. They want to attach sleep to something. They're like, oh, frost rate kind of makes no sense. It's cold outside, you just want to take a nap. <laughs> Man, you're not wrong. Ray. <laughs> Jeez, car. Dude, I kind of want to go through. I don't have that kind of time. Man, I'd love to, though. I want to go through this entire playlist. Like, the entirety of my run of this game. And just... Kind of... Look and see and count how many criticals Gar has gotten in this game. It's a lot. 
Like, he has not been kind to our enemies. But yeah, that would take many, many hours. <laughs> I'd have to get pretty bored to go through and do that. One day, maybe. <laughs> I just want, like... I want to, like, update his frickin' his, like, stone in the bottom of Angel Tower that says how many dragons he's killed, and include how many crits he's gotten in this whole run. <laughs> I think he killed 499 dragons, right? Or was it 501? I forget. Oh, yeah, this is the stuff that we missed. We can actually check this out. Oh, right! There's shops right here. I then. Okay, I forgot about that. <laughs> cool. We don't have to go friggin' all over the world. Now we have... Screw the fairies, dude. I'm not worried about them. I don't think I care about antidotes, right? Panaceas are better. Just get 30 of them. Actually, we can fill it out. There we go. Fill out our ammonias as well. I wonder if this place sells weapons and stuff, too. Weapons and armor? Oh, there's another guy over there. Hi. Go 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 ga 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 yourself. Yes, it does. Okay. Oh, the gunger. Not as good as the freaking beast spear. So I probably should have gone through here and bought all this stuff before I went in to fight everything. Well, at least we can build up some money uh, now. We might have to go fishing again. Just to get money. Um, yeah, that's from Mom, or uh, Nina. I'm not worried about that. Seeking sword, also not worried about that. Gunger, not worried about that. That brass claws, no. Atomic bomb for Momo, no. So this armor is what we really want. We could buy a force armor for Ray and a royal armor for Gar. That'll actually bring Ray's speed up. That's pretty good. Protectors are not as good as everything we've got. Mind Shield is better for Ray, but he's got Spike Gauntlets right now. Well, he's not even doing any good damage, though, so who cares? Probably buy a Mind Shield for him. Sun Mask is good for both Ray and Gar. Buy one. Clip it on Ray. Better than the Lacquer Helm. Now we can sell the Lacquer Helm. Amber Breastplate can go. Damascus Mail can go. That's what Mountain can go. Lack of Shield. Silver Mail. Man, I can sell a lot of stuff. Crap, I didn't know this was all sitting here. Alright, let's buy another Sun Mask. Put on Gar. Mind Shield on Ray could be pretty useful. Drops a speed, though. I don't know if I like that. But he's going to get a speed up from, uh... Claymore. He's going to get a speed up from the, uh... Force Armor, though, so... Demon Bane is... Not pointless, I guess. Um... Heavy Dagger we can get rid of. Let's get rid of the other Claymore. Lacquer Helm can go. Alright, Force Armor for Ray. Okay, well, let me sell the Blizzard Mail. Hey, I can't believe I came here and didn't realize this was all here. Where did the Blizzard Mail go? Oh, there it is. So, I still need to buy one Royal Armor, right? And perhaps a Mind Shield. We're in good shape now, dang, dude. Um, let me go out of Karajan now and save. Holy crap. How did I not know there was an endgame shop there? What is wrong with me?
<sighs> anyway. <laughs> What's up, Gar? I... Oh, I'm sorry is all you can say right now? Got it. I'll save Ratcha. We'll go check on the fairies anyway, why not? And we're right here. It's no big deal. Meh. Meh. I can't believe I went all the way across the map to get equipment for Momo and stuff. And for Rangar when there was a freaking shop right there. Okay. think do you want to do you want to fish again this is this is me totally trying to rationalize that we need something when really I just want to fish more <laughs> what do you guys think should we get the life armor from fishing should we go ahead and try and do that screw it man let's go I want the life armor So we're going to get it, and I get to fish more. That means, uh, Emmanuel will get to visit his cousins. In the Combinat fishing spot. We'll just dip him in the water and heal him from going across the desert. He'll be fine. We'll let him breathe for a second, and then we'll shove him back in our pocket and take him to meet God. And the jellyfish family has like a whole lore of uh, <laughs> like the guardians do. <laughs> Guardian Emmanuel, why have you returned? I thought you were entering the stone sleep. <laughs> the sand sleep. God still won't appear to you? <laughs> it's, it's the, God, Amiria instructed. <laughs> the jellyfish to exterminate all the piranha. There's still evil in the world because there's piranha everywhere. It's an epic war. That's why they're called Mana War. <laughs> and Emmanuel is their champion. I never expected this jellyfish to get a backstory, but here we are. <laughs> he was hooked by the chosen ones. Alright, so let's go ahead and I'm gonna save here, I don't wanna lose my lures. So life armor was like I know it's three Baron D, I don't know what else. I think I'm gonna be safe and uh, catch three each of Spearfish and Whales. And then go to Dayona and catch three Baron D. I know it's three Baron D. Oh, I guess I could just fish up Manilow real quick and ask him. Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, for crap's sake, I just got freaking trolled by the game. I tried to enter the fishing spot, I passed it by one pixel, and then I got an encounter and hit fucking X. That is stupid. That's so dumb. <laughs> you guys are crap. I don't even want to mess with you. Ray, can you kill these? Your intelligence sucks, dude. Come on. Oh, well, good job, dude. He's like, yeah. Two times respect me. Multivitamin. Okay, cool. Freaking trolling 
badass battle map. Get ready? Uh, oh, look, his friend jumped up to say hi to Man Man or or Emmanuel. Alright, so, let me throw the coin out and just talk to Manila real quick. See how much his life armor is. fishing in this game. That reminds me, I gotta get a fishing license this year and go real people fishing. What up, dude? Let's see how much your life is. One whale, one spearfish, three barony. Okay, not bad. Ooh, shaman ring is good, too. One whale, three spearfish, and five red catfish. Forget what they... What the red catfish bite on. Is it frogs? I think I can look up my uh, stats on the fish I've caught, and it says what kind of lures they like, right? Yeah, let me put these in the notes. I might, I might want a shaman's ring, too. That would be really, really good. Uh, that is... Let me just, let me just do total how much of everything I need. Three, four, four spearfish. Uh, let's see. Two whale. Right? Because the life armor is one whale. Yeah. Two whales. Three baron D. And. Five red catfish. That's right, boys and girls, and those of unspecified gender, it is going to be a fishing episode. <laughs> Alright, cool. So, we need to catch while we're here. Four spearfish and two whales. So, let's get that deep diver going. Shouldn't take too long, actually. One up here. Don't get stuck. What are you? No, you're not coming with Man, Man Emmanuel. Jeez. There's only one jellyfish that can come with us. Dang it, dude. How did I miss him the first time? I'm... Dang it. That's right. There we go. What are you? Besides a fighter, holy crap. It's a whale. Oh my god, 43, 44. Get back here, dude. The screen isn't even scrolling anymore. Come on. It's gonna be a big whale. Stop! <laughs> Dang. Very good. Okay, it didn't even beat my record though. That was guess not as big as I thought it was. Okay. There's our one whale. We need one more whale and four spearfish. No. Oh, the freaking big fish probably would have bit that before the jellyfish would have, but oh well. Alright, we gotta do a quick maneuver here. Yeah, let's go. Alright. Spearfish. Yeah. Very good. All right. 
So, we're down to needing three spearfish, one whale, three barren D5 red catfish. All right. Let's get back out there. All right, where's the big shadow? There's a big boy. Come on. Come on, buddy. Really? <sighs> I gotta be real careful not to lose my lure since I'm just kind of rolling through this. What shadow do I go with for this one? Another spear fish. Come on. Hey. Not mess with me, dude. I'm in no mood. <laughs> tricky, tricky. Cool. Very good. Two spearfish left to get. far out there now. I don't know if I can reach it, even if I would have got a perfect cast. Uh-oh. You get away. All right. Let's, let's go out and reset the, reset the ocean here. And because I'm terrified of losing my deep diver, because I only have one, I'll run and save real quick. There's a lot of stuff we need to do in this episode, so this one's going to be long. Especially since I just added the fishing aspect. Ray, you going to say anything about Tipo, dude? the last save point of the game, so it's like everybody's all serious. <sighs> Alright. Back to fishing. The most serious part of the game. Good baby. Alright. Two spearfish and one whale we still need to get from here. Wow, they're really far out this time. Just trying to lure them closer in. They'll get here eventually. No. Oh my god. <laughs> this is Emmanuel's posse. Stay away from my deep diver, dudes. That's a good cast. Get as far out there as we can. Ah, oh, dude, these things aren't coming up. It's fucking freaking jellyfish day. That guy was sidewinding. Did you see him? He was like freaking get it, dude. Oh god, right in the middle of all of them. Nope, 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 nope. 
Okay, we gotta reset this. <laughs> I'm not dealing with... I'm not dealing with the, the brothers' man of war here. Those dudes were aggressive. Good ready? Bunch of them up there. Come on, big guys. Just taking them a minute to get up there. They'll they'll find their way eventually. I don't have a rod that goes farther than the spanner that I'm aware of. Wait, maybe the deluxe rod does go farther. Yeah. It's just harder to shit. It's just harder to cast and it's harder to uh, pull fish in with. Uh, it doesn't go that much farther than the spanner. I don't think it's worth it. Man, they're, they're not coming up. It's not the day, is it? Good ready? I'm always ready. Okay, they're up a little closer now. That's better. Of course, I have to keep dodging jellyfish. Such is life. There we go. There we go. Oh my god, that stamina bar. Big fella. Come on, come on, come on, get off of there. Come on. Yeah. Very good. Another one hundred and twenty. All right. That's it for whales. We got all the whales we need. Now I need spearfish. Here's hoping this big guy is a spearfish right here. Yeah. The way that spearfish move on this little meter here kind of just makes me picture them as like super piranha because the piranhas are all over the place this is just a stronger piranha basically <laughs> they do not give up hey he gave up cool Very good. all right one more spearfish and we are good to go dude hopefully that other dark shadow is one that one over there. You gotta get past. Well, the flying fish won't bite on this. But the man war will. So I gotta dodge him. Come on. Come on. Oh, shit. Alright. I was worried about my lure getting caught on the rocks there, too. Hey, buddy. Come on. No, you want it. 
spearfish? Yes. All right. Just had to wait for the, the fishing day to be right, man. Got exactly everything we needed in one go. Oh, we're not there yet. This guy is a fight me. Ah. Yeah. Very good. All right, cool. So that's everything we need from this fishing spot. Dip Emmanuel on the water. Tell your friends and family goodbye. We're on our way to Dayuna to get some Barandy and some catfish. I don't think there's anything that could kill me in the colony right now, but I'm going to save anyway. Then again, if that dude with his blizzard book is still hanging around, we never did kill him. He's probably telling all his other Codger friends, man, there was this one time, this big dude looked like a freaking dragon showed up with his dumb friends, and I just flipped to my favorite chapter and almost destroyed all of them, and they ran away. Damn right we did. <laughs> Oh, what did I go in the steel grave for? That was stupid. It's not where I wanted to go. There we go. are still trying to fight us. Ray is getting closer to a level. He's very far behind. Soraka and all that crap. Pretty sure we need relay point B, right? Should take us to Windia Castle. What's up, Emmete? Got any money? No, of course not. The wife does. Your daughter does. Your golem does not. <laughs> Alright, before we go fishing for our Baron D and catfish, let's go check on the fairies, shall we? good by now. It's been a while. We haven't checked since before the Desert of Death, right? Alright. Yeah, a lot of stuff happened here. Oh, 
Hopefully we can make the antique shop now. No. Predicts the future. Huh. Right, we don't want gift. This might... The gift place might have something for us now. Let's make a fortune teller. Why not? Yeah, I think we're, we're totally built up now. This is as big as the place gets. Yep. Cool. Here's your present. A fish head. Thanks. <laughs> Just found it laying around somewhere. Better not leave this room. There's... That's it. Oh, what? 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 What do you mean? Is there a freaking ghost? I've never seen this before. I'm gonna leave the room. <laughs> Ray's like, I wonder what's gonna happen. Yeah, that's that's a terrifying port portent, actually. <laughs> okay, so there's nothing much we can do here. I thought we might get the antique shop, which would have uh, let us sell our plate and our uh, gems and stuff for a lot of money, but that's okay. Red catfish, I think, bites on frogs, just like the Barony, because they're similar style fish, if I'm not mistaken. spot. I think I can check my fish records and it says preferred lore. Good ready? Where are you? There you are. Likes to eat frogs. Yep, okay. Barony's the same way. and stuff in here, too, that are gonna trip me up when I'm trying to catch the catfish. Oh my god, there's so many big shadows. Are you near, bass? I can tell by your dang stamina bar. You're not a red catfish. So we're gonna have all kinds of problems, <laughs> probably, because bass bite on everything, too. Pretty much everything. Hey, five of these dudes? Mm. Dang, man. <laughs> that that's one. A bass would have would have freaking gone straight for it. fishing. <laughs> We're going to have a whole truckload of these after a while. They're not bad healing items. They do heal 80, if I remember correctly. One of these is bound to give me an updated record on bass. This bass. Big fella. Ooh, I had a tech three. Nice. That's bass. Dang it. I wasted a tech three on a freaking bass, dude. I can't hit that very consistently. Good. Hey. 
are the best. Damn. Getting real sick of you guys. Pretty sure there's like one, maybe one or two red catfish per uh, loaded fishing spot, I imagine. They wouldn't like put a ton of them in here. It's a rare fish. I knew you were going to do that right at the shore. I knew it. <laughs> Dang it, I keep missing my perfect cast. Curses. You gotta be a bass, too. Yeah. Well, he yanked me pretty good for a minute there. Dang, dude, you didn't fight at all. You gotta be small, right? 22, yeah. There's a good cast. Oh my gosh. More bass. Yeah, see, luckily in the uh, Barandy fishing spot, there's no other big, big fish besides the Barandy, I'm pretty sure, so you never have to gamble on what the shadows are. for a shaman turn. You're gonna help us kill God. That's cool. There you go. Very great. Very great. Alright, we got one. Four more. <laughs> Once we clear all the bass out of here, it'll be perfect. I wonder if all these dark shadows moved up and a lot of them are catfish. I'm sure they're mostly bass. I mean, there's one right in front of the shore. It never hurts to try. Hi. Hello. That's bass. It, oh no, that's freaking catfish. Oh my gosh, he's wild, dude. Get back here. Get back here. You're gonna drag me all the way out, aren't you? Nope. 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 No, sir. That's two. Very good. So I guess some of them did come up to the shore. Nice, dude. What about you guys? Any of you? My friends? Eh. I'm sure one of those is. Yeah? Hey. Ah, that's fast. Curses.
take that. You are a mess. So many of you bundles. That guy out there is probably one. I don't think this one up here is. Yeah, this is a bass. That's a really small catfish. No, it's bass. Hi there, I think I made it to you. Can you be a catfish? Ah, oh, you're a bass. Oh, you're a catfish. That's weird. You just must be a really, really small one, huh? You're a baboon. That's three. Two left to get here. There's nothing but octopi around now. Alright, now we need to reload the thing. Yep, two more red catfish and we're good to go to get the three barandy we need. Which hopefully won't take... Shadows, most of them probably bass. <gasps> I got a tech four, but that was a bass heading for it. It's been a while since I've seen a gold number on my techs. Let's just try this guy. Bass. Good. All right, perfect cast. Big shadows out here. Dang it, man. That was my fault. Indecision took over. I hit the tech too. That guy beelined for it. And then I tried to get a hit on it. What are you? size bass though, 37. Hey. 
catfish. Where they knew what they were doing when they put all the, these bass in here. They knew you would have to roll the dice. There might be a slight difference between the sizes of the shadows that I just don't see. Ah, it was a new record. I told you eventually one of them would end up giving me a new record. About this that is a red catfish. Because the bass would have bit it right off. Let's see if I remember what shadow it was. Nope, oh, there's two now. Great. That's bass. Hey! Buddy? Fish in this game are a lot smarter than what we have credit for in real life. That's bass. Going going through the motions of clearing out all the bass again. I still need two red catfish, right? Yeah. Jeez, man. I haven't hooked one yet on this trip. Again, we're building up a ton of bass that, like I said, they're decent healing items. It's another bass, okay. Whatever. Eventually, if we catch all the big shadows, the same thing will happen this time. It's happened. We'll catch a red catfish if it's in here. Because we're not trying to avoid any shadows. Every cast, we're getting something at least cleared out of the fishing area. Dang it. We're eliminating the ones that aren't red catfish, basically. That's what we're doing right now. That's catfish. Let's go. Come on, kitty. Catfish. Stop teasing me, dude. Make it the first one I hooked. That would be fantastic. That's gonna be a bass. Yeah, that's a bass. <laughs> wouldn't let me, uh, wouldn't just let me have it, would you? Let's clear the ones out that are up here by the shore here. See what they end up being. That's too bad. <gasps> no! Uh, if I lost my other frog door, it just put a new one on automatically. I have three of them, so that's a mess. It kind of ran straight at my lure there. I imagine it's a mess. 
Big fat total of five. Time for three Baron D, which could be really fast or it could take forever. We're gonna have to see. sleeping there, fairy cat. Yeah. Being a good boy. Ooh, big stretch. Alright. Legendary fish time. I need three of these bad boys. Good ready? It's the only big body fish in the lake, I'm pretty sure. So, I think it's the only thing that bites on uh, frogs as well. So, it really, this is going to be a waiting game until one gets closer into shore so I can reach it. I don't even see any out there right now. you. That's not far enough. Well. Friggin' piranha. Ooh. <laughs> Alright, I see how this is gonna go. I see how this is gonna go. Alright, he's up far now. Away from the piranha. Come on, dude. in this perfect cast. There you go. Come on, buddy. You look like one of those gummy fish from when I was a kid. Stamina. Stop. Got him. Alright. That's one. Ooh, new record. Let's go. Any more of your friends out here? There's one over there. Get away from me, Piranha. <laughs> he was so ready. single lure. You can never escape Piranha. Ah! <laughs> I tried so hard.
that's a good cast. <sighs> Bastard. He goes at it for a second and then is like, nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Frickin' Piranha, they swarm around him. He's protected by a shield of buttholes. Come on. Oh my god. I think I have to hit the tax to get him to even bite. see him. He's way up here. Like, close to the shore. Hey, buddy. <gasps> you freaked! That was a... This... This piranha is an ace pilot, dude. He freaking sniped me. Jeez. Good. Good. Thanks, announcer. You, you actually got hype for the piranha. I appreciate that. No. No. Yeah. Yes, this is my last one. Let's go. Ooh, he's dragging me. He's dragging me. Come on. Yes! Very good. Fishing trip over. All right, now we can go get our stuff. Get a shaman's ring and a life armor. That's what we did all of that for. It was worth it. It was definitely worth it. I gotta save. Just, just the thought of like. Something stupid happening when I leave the colony to go to the Commonat to talk to Ma uh, Manilo and me dying <laughs> and having to catch those Barony all over again. Yeah, that that doesn't bode well. See, now I could put the life armor on Gar, and that would counterbalance the uh, HP he loses from uh, the Beast Spear. Or I could put it on Ryu. Which seems like the better option, because I feel like Ryu is more important to keep alive. Then again, I don't know. We'll find out. We'll, we'll decide. Because when we roll around. 
random dragon, it will make it cost less. Which is really nice. So if we roll True Kaiser, it won't cost 53, it'll cost like 20 something. Well, hello, guys. Just need to go see my fishmonger, dude. <sighs> I do. Peace. So that's officially the end of fishing. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else that I want. There's a decent amount of fishing spots that I didn't go to. And there's a couple of fish that I never caught. But that's okay. We really just needed Royal Sword, Life Armor, and Shaman's Ring are like the best things you can get from fishing in my opinion. There's a couple other good things too that you can get, but those are basically the best. <laughs> Alright, I will take a life armor and a shaman's ring. Thank you very much. See you next playthrough, Mello. Alright, so shaman's ring. Boots for a shaman's ring. I like Ryu having the ring of fire. Let's see, dragon armor or life armor? Life armor's better. It's way better. I think I like them having the force. I think Ryu needs more defense. Then again, I mean, Ray has no defense. And low HP. I think it's probably better for him. If we take it off of him eventually, we'll put it on Ryu. But I think he's the right candidate for it. Alright, so. That's all said and done. We are stocked up on items. I'm really worried about the freaking fairy that cursed us. Told us not to leave the room.
Alright, so we're on our way back to Kerjon. To the save point that we were at at the beginning of the episode. We're getting ready to start up on the, the second half of this episode. Obviously the first half was all about fishing. shaman's ring which is really nice so we're getting back to where we were because we're getting ready to do the boss rush and fight all those freaking samples down in the uh, bottom of Kerjan at 1 HP. Now, if I had the patience, I could get another life armor if I went and got it from the desert, but not, not something that I feel like doing at the moment. The Desert of Death is a nice little part of the game, but once you're done with it, you kind of want to be done with it, you know? Now, if we were going for a completion, yeah, I'd definitely go do that, but... Alright. So, we are in Kerjan, and we should be here for the rest of the run. We should not have to leave for anything. How much money do I have? Can't afford anything decent in there. Alright. Alright, back up we go, ladies and gents. Shaking for a guard, it's not that scary. <laughs> okay, well, peace out then. I have the initiative. <laughs> What's that way? Oh, right. Okay. Damn my curiosity. <laughs> Right. 
rest it up. <laughs> you're cracking me up, dude. The way you're sleeping. Alright, so first half of the episode over. Second half begins in just a moment. I have to run and use the facilities real quick. I shall return.